actually downloaded and installing Packet Tracer in Linux. So the first thing that you will need to do is go to your browser and we will be searching for Packet Tracer by going to the Netacad website. So let me type in download Packet Tracer. You can do the same. Okay, here is a option. Okay, so you're going to be choosing this link, which has Cisco Packet Tracer Networking Simulation Tool. So what we will need to do is up search scroll down, click on the option that says View Course, click on Skills for All. Because what we will need to do, guys, is actually sign up for a course in order to get access to the download or packet tracer so it has redirected us to another page where we'll be signing up for this course which you don't have to take if you don't want but if you want to take the course and learn how to use packet tracer more effectively as fast as possible you can go ahead and take the course we're going to click on where it says get started Okay, so right now it's giving you an option to actually log in. But what you're going to be clicking on is actually sign up. Okay, so you can select your country, your date of birth, and click on continue. Now you put in your first name, your last name. And a random, well, you put in a, the correct email address, but I'm gonna just put in a random email. But you can ensure that yours is correct because you need to actually log into the website. You need to know all your information. And you should take a look at the criteria for the password, as it says, password requirements. Okay, you'd click on create account after you've completed that. Okay. Let me see here. Okay, so that's one criteria that they have. Okay, so now I'm being re redirected to the terms and conditions. Let me click on those. Okay, so what you would do from here is click on where it says click here to view. Okay, so you scroll down, it's coming up. Now I'm going to click on where it says install Cisco Packet Tracer. Okay, so this is the link that I actually want to actually start the download. So I'm going to click on it. As you can see, you were re redirected to a, another page of the website. And then this page is where you get the download link for Ubuntu. So this is what you'd actually download. I've already downloaded, 
that link so I'm just gonna go straight to terminal okay so now that I'm in terminal what I'm gonna do is actually navigate to the download folder so I'm gonna type in CD downloads okay and now I'm gonna take a look in the downloads folder as you can see it has Cisco packet tracer within the folder okay so what I'm gonna do now it's typing the code to get downloaded, so it's gonna be sudo dpkg hyphen i, and now I am going to copy the link, and that would be shift plus control plus the letter C to copy, shift plus control plus C plus V to actually paste. Then I press enter. I put in my password. And as you can see, it is now installing. I'm going to click on OK. Do you accept the terms of this? Let's say yes to that. And it's unpackaging and processing right now. Okay, so the process has completed, but guys, this is a issue that you'd actually find with Packet Tracer when you're installing it. It says uh, dependency problem prevent configuration of Packet Tracer, which means that we will need to actually get the dependency files for it to actually install successfully because it was not installed. So to do that, what we would do is type in sudo. apt install hyphen f and press enter and now it's installing those you're gonna click y for yes press enter so now the dependency files are being installed and we will be required to reinstall packet tracer for it to actually work and even if it gives the same message again, it will still be installed because the dependent dependency file have been installed. Okay guys, so that was successfully done. So the next step is to actually install Packet Tracer. And you can always press the up arrow on your keyboard to actually get back some of your code lines. Let me see if I can get mine to return. Don't want that one. Now this is the one that you'd want and you'd press enter. Click on OK, click yes. And let it do its thing. Okay, so now it has been completed, guys. So this is how you actually install Cisco Packet Tracer in Linux. And it doesn't really matter the version of Linux that you're actually using. This is the method that you actually use. So let's see how you'd actually find it in Linux to actually run it. So what you could do is type in the name in terminal, and the name will actually vary the way as it has to do with terminal running the program for you, the name will actually vary in different versions of Linux. And for this one, I'm just going to type in Packet Tracer. And it will work for me. So as you can see, it says Start Packet Tracer, and it shows you the version of Packet Tracer. I can also get this done by actually 
pressing the alt and f2 and the finder will come up and i can type in the name so yeah this is how you actually get to install and run packet tracer in linux guys so if there's any question that you have guys with actually getting installed and running packet tracer in linux you can go ahead leave your comment underneath this video and i'll be happy to answer your questions and assist you in actually getting this done so guys if you like the content that you just saw remember to give this video a thumbs up remember to subscribe and click on the notification bell in that way you will be one of the first person to see my next video